Guys, we made it to Monster Jam. If you guys can see through the fence, it's kind of hard, but this is the behind the scenes where the monster trucks get dropped off in the big, huge semis. And then they take the little tires and swap them out for the big tires. I'll show you guys a little view here. This is downtown Detroit. And that smoke comes out of everywhere. It's the sewers. In case you didn't know. But yep, we made it to Monster Jam. We already got our tickets. We already parked the truck. We already went and got something nice to eat. We ate at five, what's it called? Five Guys Burgers and Fries. Five Guys Burgers and Fries. So yeah, that's the Maximum Destruction Monster Jam Semi. We'll get some more video for you guys. Monster Jam is gonna be at the Ford Field where usually the Lions are. There's the little parking thing. We had to pay $25 for parking. This year was a ripoff. But I'm glad we got here early because um, all the people are piling into the parking lot over there and there's already a line of people waiting to get their tickets. I don't know if you can see them, but there's hundreds of people. So we'll catch you guys in a couple seconds. Guys, we made it inside. We're inside the Ford Field. It's not super busy because we had to pay extra for the pit passes. They were 20 bucks a person. Check out all the Monster Jam merchandise. And we will get back with you when we get down to the bottom of the pit. <laughs> Guys, we made it. We're inside Monster Jam. Guys, we made it. We're at the Monster Jam pit party. They just opened up, so they're just now letting everybody in. And we will catch you guys in a few minutes. Welcome to the Drop Shop Garage. <clears throat> We're at Monster Jam. We're at the pit party. And this is the most famous truck here. The Grave Digger. <clears throat> Check out that front axle. Wow. They got it all armor-alled up. It won't be armor-alled much longer. The headlights always light up. They light up red when he's running. And they always play that song. Doo -doo -doo -doo. But yep, this is the Grave Digger. <laughs> Guys, I'm not really sure what this thing's called. Maybe the Throttle Monster. Yes, it's called Raptor. It's on top of a thing that's like 15 feet tall. They got them all shined up, all the tires, and it says the Throttle Monster. It's starting to get busy down here. And once again, we are at the Ford Field. Detroit, Michigan. The big D.
maximum the maximum destruction. This one, guys, is maximum destruction. And if you've ever wondered why maximum destruction goes out there and tears it up, it's because this front axle is like totally reinforced. It's reinforced like how they do lowrider cars. You can see where they, it's got all the welds, welds, welds. It's even got chains like a lowrider so that it doesn't overextend. Loops around the drive shaft. So now I know why this one is so tough. It's got a whole reinforced axle. Check out these tires, 66 inch BKTs. Maximum destruction. So here they have three cars buried in the dirt me and the Panda Man are gonna try to guess and see what kind of cars these are. This one, I have no clue. I don't know. Panda Man has no clue either. This one, I can't even barely see it. You wanna take a guess? I don't know. I definitely don't know what the third one is. The third one is a Nissan, and that's because we can see the emblem right there. But yeah, they have these buried in like eight feet of dirt. And here we have El Toro Loco. And there's the driver. Here we have little kids driving grave diggers. Oh, I know why. The little mask is like how when the real driver puts a fireproof mask. But they're probably just so bad. They make them wear a little fireproof mask and a helmet. And their little mini grave diggers. And the headlights actually light up. Pretty cool. Guys, we have the Mohawk Warrior, and now it's sponsored by Great Clips. Check out these tires. The 66 inch BKTs, super armor all up. And one of the sponsors is a K&N filter. Here's the great clips, and they're giving all the little kids a mohawk and spray painting their hair. They'll spray paint your hair and give you a mohawk for free. And a man didn't want one, I asked him. So back to the Mohawk Warrior. I showed you guys the Armoral tires. 
There's the supercharged engine with some serious, serious headers going on. There's the transmission. They got some serious money into this.
stories that you are submitting right now at judgeszone.com. Already a winner twice tonight. Will he get another one? We're gonna find out.